हेलो आई एम डॉक्टर एम सुधाकर राव कंसल्टेंट कार्डियोलॉजिस्ट मणिपाल हॉस्पिटल बैंगलोर टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट कोलेस्ट्रॉल लेवल्स व्हाट यू नीड टू नो बेसिकली कोलेस्ट्रॉल इज अ फैट लाइक सब्सटेंस व्हिच इज फाउंड इन वेरियस सेल्स ऑफ द बॉडी एंड आल्सो द लीवर सिंथेसाइजेस इट बट यू आल्सो फाइंड इन सम फूड सच एज द मीट एंड द डेयरी प्रोडक्ट कोलेस्ट्रॉल इज नीडेड फॉर द बॉडी टू फंक्शन प्रॉपर्ली हाउ एवर टू मच एंड एक्सेस ऑफ कोलेस्ट्रॉल leads to various diseases like the heart attack stroke and blockage in various part of the body like the leg arteries and the abdominal arteries normally we measure what is known as fasting lipid profile in empty stomach basically some 9 to 12 hours of fasting and this report gives a detailed thing about total cholesterol triglycerides ldl or the bad cholesterol hdl or the good cholesterol and other things like the non hdl levels the normally the target and the number should be a total cholesterol of less than 200 triglyceride levels of less than 200 ldl or bad cholesterol of less than 100 hdl or good cholesterol of more than 45 Normally there are some non modifiable factors and there are modifiable factors. The non modifiable factors are the age, the sex and the race whereas the modifiable factors are the diet, weight, lifestyle activity, smoking, stress and alcohol. Also there are diseases like diabetes, hypothyroidism and certain medications which can alter the cholesterol levels. If you are age 45 years or lower you can get it checked once in 3 to 5 years however if you are 45 years and above you should measure it once in 1 to 2 years frequency of measure should also depend on the family history the age and the type of disease you have there are two ways one is with medications and one is by changing your lifestyle activity like getting involved in various physical activities running jogging cycling walking of around 30 to 45 minutes per day for around 150 minutes per week quit smoking reduce the intensity of alcoholism also by decreasing the level of stress taking healthy food like decreasing the red meat can increase the polyunsaturated fatty acid intake you should decrease the monounsaturated fat as much as possible so if you are a diabetic and your ldl levels are beyond 100 one should always be on a cholesterol medication what is known as statin therapy however if you are a non diabetic and your ldl or the bad cholesterols are more than 190 then one should always be on a statin therapy if your ldl levels are beyond 190 you should also think about whether it's a genetic form of hypercholesterolemia and we should screen the family members like the siblings also if your levels are between 100 to 190 and your risk score what we call it ascvd risk score is high then sometime we advise for test like the calcium score of the heart or if you are a pa- patient with a heart failure or a chronic kidney disease then we start the person on a cholesterol medication